This is my 1970 Westphalia Pop Top Camper Bus. Um, put a lot of time and a lot of money into it. And I just had another motor put in it. Uh, the motor runs super smooth. It runs and drives really nice. Uh, paint's got good shine to it. Very solid bus. Um, when I got it, the only rust in it's just a teeny little bit that's right there and then uh, the battery tray had a little in it and I had a new tray welded in there. Um, just a fun, fun bus all the way around. Uh, it could use a new canvas on the pop top part. I have patched them before. My last one I, I was able to patch, but this one's got a couple pretty big holes in it, so it really should be replaced. Which you can get the replacements real cheap. Um, but it's real quiet, real smooth. Uh, open it up here for you see inside I just put uh, new carpet in and the seats aren't in too bad a shape there could be recovered real easy it's the original yellow uh, seats and this folds down into a nice little bed um, the flip up table still there when I got it this one had the original uh, sink set up for right there but it was missing but I do have the jump seat in the box that goes there um, that someone can re redo the seat covers on. Um, well, the guy I got it from said it was the original miles on it. It reads about 53,000 miles and I believe it because it drives like it has 53,000. Um, and it was real clean other than, you know, the seats aren't in the best of condition. They could be recovered as well. The paneling is in pretty good shape and all the cabinets and all the drawers and everything are in good shape. Um, it's got the cupboard underneath here, underneath the seat too. Let me take you around underneath the back here. Open the back up. And then there's a view from the back side. It's got the spare right there and the cabinets back here. I also, the pop top has a bunk that folds out and there's a bunk that sleeps there. And then I also have a cot bunk that goes across the front over top of the two seats. And that works real well. Uh, like I said, the motor, I had it completely gone through, and I had the carburetors all rebuilt, new fuel lines, um, I had new exhaust and new header, header uh, exhaust gaskets put on, so the motor's nice and smooth like it should be. Um, go ahead and fire the motor up for you real quick. A little restoration work could be finished on it, and the front window's not in the best of condition, so it should be replaced. But literally starts right up with the flick of a key and as you can tell it sounds nice and quiet like a VW should all in all it makes someone a real nice fun camping camping rig we've sure enjoyed it I hate parting with it but it's uh, it's time someone else to enjoy it thank you very much